In a damp, squalid, miserable fishing hamlet, a dead god lies on the sand. This is Mother Koss, torn from the deep by a fishing hook. She's the source of the church's obsession with the Great Ones, the choirs, abuses, the mad science of the School of Menses, and all of the horrors that followed. But when you find her, she's not a godlike presence. She's not majestic or overwhelming. She doesn't even look very supernatural. She's just a sad, pathetic pile of flesh in the dirty gray sand. A lump of nothing under an overcast sky, no more magnificent than a jellyfish that's washed ashore. Her concept art shows her with a little more dignity, and you can see that in this see in her own environment she might have been beautiful, but as a corpse she's only tragic. The hunters of the church desecrate her body for their science, and by the time you get there you understand why they were cursed to the hunter's nightmare for their crimes. They call her a goddess, but they treat her like cattle. They tear out her insides, desperate to ascend, ignorant of the fact that she and we came from the same place, the universal mother, the depths of the life-giving sea. Subscribe here for shorts to see my detailed analysis of this character over on my main channel.